Happy Monday, you guys. I feel like I have not talked to y'all in a minute. Like, I haven't really vlogged since I came back from Jersey. So today is April 8th, Monday, April 8th. So if you are new here, welcome to my channel. My name is Rika. I love everything pink. I'm a serial entrepreneur. I help people start businesses, whether it's lashes, lip gloss. I just placed some water in my eye. Lashes, lip gloss, vending machines. Your girl has 10 vending machines. If you need help with that, I got you. So make sure you subscribe. Make sure y'all hit the like button if you're not new. Welcome back. So like I said, y'all, today's Monday. I'm making it a mission to go to the gym four times a week, mainly because it's summertime. But even without it being summertime, I do want to go to the gym at least three times a week. But because summer is two months away, my birthday is two months away, summer babies, it's almost our time to shine. Okay, Cancer Gang, if you a Cancer, comment. But it's almost our time to shine, you guys. So I'm trying to like, I have this whole, like I seen a video about like writing down your ideal day. So that's what I did. So I wrote down like my ideal day is waking up, praying, of course, getting myself together, making my bed, um, drinking a glass of water, going to the gym if I'm going to the gym that day, drinking a breakfast smoothie. So I'm trying to follow like that's some of the things that's on my ideal day. So I'm trying to, you know, abide by it every single day. And it's Monday. So why not? So we're about to go to the gym, like I said. So this outfit was sponsored from tiktok shop so i'm actually my um stand is right here i'm gonna record myself wearing it i'm trying to figure out because i know i got a bunch of sports bras but it's a pack of three so it comes with three different shorts hopefully these shorts have my butt looking big but it comes with three different shorts so y'all know i'll probably wear the pink one the only thing is i don't know what top i'm gonna wear because i have a bunch of black sports bras so it's either i'm gonna wear the black one but i really want to wear the pink one it's just a matter of finding something to match it but this is what i have well this is what it comes with so it comes with these three different colors and these three different shorts i always get mediums in my bottoms especially in this type of material because it'll be like way too tight so i'm gonna go ahead and record that video so for the agenda for today we're gonna go to the gym. Once I go to the gym, we're going to clean up. I did not do my Sunday reset yesterday. Yesterday was kind of like more of a chill day. Like y'all, I have to go live in my Patreon. My Patreon is my business mentoring group. So we go live there every Monday, but we did change the time because usually we go live 5 p.m. CST and we change it to 6 p.m. CST. So I still have time because it's only 11.40. So we gotta go to the gym. We gotta, I gotta make my breakfast smoothie. We gotta go to the gym. We gotta clean, do laundry. I don't have that much dishes to wash because I just cooked yesterday. But clean the kitchen up, clean my bathroom. We have to pack orders. DHL should be arriving today. So we gotta do that. And then I have to work on my vending machine mentoring. So if you don't know, I do have vending machine mentoring open in full effect. And... Let, let me not y'all let me i almost forgot to tell you guys this because i haven't told y'all in a minute but my very first mentee she's my first met location mentee my very first mentee her machine is on the way but my very first location mentee took her vending machine to the mall on april 1st so big congratulations to her we got her location secured her machine is in the mall i'm gonna insert a picture of it right here so congratulations to my mentee if you are interested in getting into vending machines make sure you grab my starter pack on the website if you are serious if you want to learn about it if you know nothing about vending machines grab that starter pack my vendors included everything you need to know how to contact malls what you need uh what's a what what is required the expenses the behind the scenes and i just dropped another part so if you did purchase the starter pack you should have got an email with part number 10 there are now 10 videos in the starter pack bundle and i will be recording part number 11 for you guys this week when i get my hair done because because i'm not even gonna lie to y'all i just put this wig on my head and put this band on but anyways y'all let me go ahead and record this video real quick so I could um, post it on my TikTok, like gym day, and then we're gonna make our smoothie, and then I'm going to head to the gym. But first, we need to pick an affirmation card. Let me go grab an affirmation card because we gotta start Monday with motivation. So these are my affirmation cards. They are available on my website. If you do need some daily motivation, these are my cards. 
my design my vendor is also on the website if you're interested in selling your own journals or affirmation cards so let's give it a good shuffle and pick a card make them wish they supported make them come on card focus make them wish they supported make them wish they supported somebody watching my video right now needed to see this there's probably people that you know that don't like your post on social media it discourages you you probably talk about your business people are not interested it discourages you you keep feel like you're doing everything possible but you're feeling discouraged Keep pushing and make the unsupporters wish that they supported. This is my favorite card. Like I told y'all, all these cards were my my like my thoughts. This is one of my favorite cards because if it was up to support, my business would be non-existent. Having no support should be all the support that you need. Even with me, y'all, when it comes to my YouTube channel, I feel like I should be way further. I've been consistent because I've been doing YouTube since 2015 when I graduated high school. But it was like an on and off thing. I would post videos and delete it. But consistently, I've been doing it for the past four years. And sometimes it's like, of course, you, you don't compare. I try not to compare because it's like, oh, this person just started their channel. They've already gotten their plaque. Meanwhile, it's like, should I start a whole new channel? Like, maybe the people that are watching me are not supportive, which I know that some of y'all are supportive because y'all comment on my videos every single time y'all hit the like button. And I want y'all to know that I love y'all. I see y'all and thank y'all so much for the support. But sometimes it do be feeling like the support is not there. You'll upload a video and you get all these views and people won't even hit the like button. People won't even subscribe. People won't even this. And it'll feel like the support is not there. But you can't worry about that. As long as you know what you want to do, you have to keep doing it. No matter what the response is, you have to keep going. I'm going to continue to pump out my YouTube videos. Whether I'm not going to do it as much as I used to in the past. Like at one one point i was uploading like three times a week five times a week if y'all want that kind of content from me y'all gotta show me that y'all are supporting me so that i can put out that kind of content because right now i'm folk like i have too many things going on like i'm doing my mentor and i'm doing this i'm doing that but i'm still gonna put on my weekly videos I'm still going to do that. And my tribe that supports me will support me. My tribe that will like and comment will do that. And I'm grateful for them. And I will continue to put out my content because eventually we're going to get to 100,000 subscribers. Eventually, my tribe that genuinely supports me, eventually my tribe that actually likes my content is going to find me. So I can't sit here and get mad like, oh my God, I posted a video and there's only two comments. There's only five comments. No, just keep putting out that content. That is stuff that's getting to your head. And when you let that stuff get into your head, that's when you're like, you know what? Is it even worth me recording today? Like, should I even pick up the camera and record? Why why even record if people are not going to support? No, put out that content. I'm telling you right now, put out that content. Put out, post your business. Your tribe is going to find you. People that genuinely support you, people that genuinely are your tribe are going to support you. So somebody watching this video right now needed to see that. Post that content. Don't worry about support. Make people wish that they supported you because guess what? At the end of the day, whatever God has planned for you, nobody can stop. So enough of the chit chat, let's get to the video. I'm gonna record the video, show you guys my end result, and we are going to head to the gym. Hey guys, so right now I'm making my protein smoothie. This right here is, when I tell y'all, this is my favorite protein smoothie. And y'all have been seeing me, if you've been watching all my vlogs, y'all have seen me use these for months this is my second bag and they sent me a third one so if you're looking for a protein powder and it's organic they have different flavors i just prefer chocolate flavor but it's organic it's vegan y'all that have been asking me Riga, how you been gaining your weight this is the only protein powder i have been using for i want to say since last Last August-ish, last July-ish, I've been only drinking this protein powder. So this is the only protein powder. You can use it as a meal replacement and I usually always drink it with my silk milk. So I rotate between fruit smoothies and protein smoothies. Like yesterday, for example, I just made me a full-on fruit smoothie, which was just like milk and fruits. 
today I'm actually making me like a meal replacement. So you are supposed to use two scoops. So I probably might add a little bit more milk because this is only gonna last me another day. I'm gonna go grocery shopping tomorrow after I go to the gym. So I put my protein powder. I already have my milk in there. I think I might still add me some fruits. That way I don't have to add ice because the fruits are frozen. So this is almond butter. This is also organic, vegan. I got this from Thrive Market. So as y'all see, I've been using my almond butter. And this right here has how many? This has seven grams of protein. And I always like to use some kind of butter, whether it's peanut butter or almond butter, so that way it doesn't taste like a protein smoothie. So we're going to put that almond butter in there. And this has 20 grams of protein. So are, we're already looking at about 30 grams of protein. And then this says eight ounces has one gram. So this shake that I make already has, like I said, about 30 grams of protein in it. So it's very full of protein. Okay, so now I'm gonna add some of my frozen strawberries. Oh, I just made a mess. Frozen strawberries and pineapples. I usually just chop these up. Like when I go to the grocery store, I buy pineapples, I buy strawberries, and I come home, wash them, cut them up, and put them in a Ziploc bag, and then I just use them throughout the week for my smoothies. So that's literally all I'm gonna do, y'all. I'm gonna blend this up. Okay, y'all, so I made my protein smoothie to go. The link will be in the description box if you want to purchase this protein powder. So good. So good. So I'm pretty much gonna be drinking this the whole time I'm on my way to the- Y'all, I went ahead and started working on my laundry. So of course, y'all, this is what I've been using. It's kind of almost done. I need to tell them to send me some more, but I'm doing my laundry. So that's gonna be going. So by the time I come back from the gym, all I gotta do is put it in. Hey you guys, so I came back from the gym. Your girl is exhausted. I just put my clothes in a dryer. So right now I'm gonna Quickly contact malls for my vending machine mentee. So y'all, I'm super excited because like I told y'all earlier, one of my mentees took her vending machine to the mall and pretty much all my vending machine mentees have a location except one that joined my mentorship a week ago. So she's in, where's her page at? She's in, I keep everything in my journal. This mentee is in Houston and she wants her vending machine to either go to Ohio or North Carolina. So we got some good leads. I just got to follow up with the mall so we can go ahead and get that lease. Okay, so once I contact those malls, I'm going to go ahead and clean up because I'm ready to shower. I'm literally ready to shower. So I'm kind of like, do I want to shower, clean up and then shower again? I don't know, but I really want to shower right now. But then I also have to clean and I have to mop and I have to sweep. I got to do all of that. So it's like, will I get that stuff done in 30 minutes? But we're going to contact these malls first. Then I think I'm going to go ahead and clean up. And then I did come home to a package. I came home to a package. It might be my other Shein collab. Okay, y'all, your girl has been... At this point, I'm a Shein brand ambassador. At this point, I'm an ambassador. I've been telling y'all how to get these brand deals. I made a whole ebook written by me, two videos showing you guys how I've been able to do it. And I, they wanted an all bathing suit um, collab. So hopefully that's what's there, even though I can't really wear it because it's not summertime yet. But your girl got so far two trips planned for the summer. So me and my sister, both of our birthdays are in June. Well, everybody's birthday in June, but we're combining our birthday trips. So we're going somewhere in June. I got another trip in July. Hopefully I could throw in one for August. But yeah, so I'm excited. I don't gotta buy no bathing suits because I got it from my collab. So let me contact these malls and I'ma check back in with y'all. And let's see, is DHL alpha delivery because y'all when i was at the gym it got so dark because of the eclipse okay yes inventory is out for delivery 
So yeah, we, we got order. Okay, you guys, so I'm about to start cleaning. This candle is from Candles Essence, y'all. I'm using the Millionaire Mindset one. I will have her info linked in the description box if you guys are interested in these candles. She has so many different ones. If you saw the video where I unboxed it, I got four different ones. They have like inspirational stuff on it. So we gonna be burning the Millionaire Mindset one today. The other candles that I got from her, this one says princess treatment only. As y'all see, they be being put to use, okay? This one says, in my soft girl era, bam. This one smells so good. So I'm about to start cleaning, take everything off my countertops. Y'all see I got my pine saw ready to go because we about to deep. I'm trying to remember to stop in between while I'm cleaning to show you guys updates because I am listening to music and y'all know how that goes. So I cleaned out this drawer, wiped it down. I also cleaned my silverware tray. Y'all, all this stuff is on my Amazon storefront. The link is always in the description box if y'all are pink lovers, you know, like myself. So I cleaned this one out. And now I already like pretty much did this side. I do have my cauliflower wings in the oven. So yeah, y'all. Okay, so what's left for me to do is to wash my dishes. I'm gonna make me some lemon water as well. Clean my countertops and everything. Then we're gonna sweep. Well, I took my wig off. Y'all already know how I am. <laughs> like when I tell y'all, I don't know what it is. I am just so sick of wearing wigs. Like, I don't want to put wig, a wig on my head. I don't want to wear braids. I just, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. But I had to take the wig off. I was going to try to push it because I am recording content. But I was like, F it. I'm not even going to show my face because I am recording. So, like, right now, I just recorded a reel for my pink Pinterest and my pink platforms because... We are posting every single day, no matter the likes, no matter the comments. Like I was telling y'all earlier, if you want to see growth, you have to be consistent and you can't think about the likes, the comments, the supports. You just got to do you. So a lot of the girls in my mentorship group are on a challenge and I'm on a challenge myself. I already told them that I was on a challenge. So on my business page, I'm posting there while well, my assistant is posting there um, daily on my business Pinterest five times a day scheduled posts are going up. As far as my personal branding goes, I'm posting on all my platforms every single day. That means YouTube shorts, that means Facebook, that means Instagram, and that means TikTok. And y'all that have been following me from the very beginning, y'all see the growth. So I'm glad I'm able to show you guys. Like I've been vlogging for the past four years. So y'all are able to see it. My personal TikTok is at 73,000 followers. My personal Instagram is at 134K. Make sure y'all follow. I'm gonna have it up on the screen. Make sure you follow, support. Don't be a hate watcher. Don't, don't be one of those. Make sure you engage. So I posted today the little gym video. It's on my Instagram page. So that was the gym video I recorded earlier. So I went ahead. I was like, do I wanna post it on my Instagram? I was like, F it. I posted it. It got 5,000 views. So that's good. I posted it on TikTok. I didn't post that one on Facebook, but I, because on Facebook and Instagram, I try to keep it one time a day. But when it comes to TikTok and YouTube shorts, I post two times a day. So I've already posted my two shorts for the day when it comes to YouTube. So, and TikTok, so anything else that I record today content-wise is going to be scheduled for the rest of the week, which is good. We're getting ahead because I was ahead when I had went to Jersey. I had all my stuff scheduled and y'all, we hit 35.3K today. Okay, slow and steady. We're going to get to that 100K plaque eventually. So if you're watching this right now, you're not subscribed, subscribe. It's free. You know you love it here. You know you love me. Okay, subscribe. So let me hurry up and clean up y'all so I can take a shower. <laughs> These cauliflower wings need to hurry up because I have not ate all day. That smoothie was the last thing that I ate. So I'm going to hurry up and clean this place up, get my content, shower, and then hopefully DHL will be here by then because it's still saying alpha delivery, which is fine. I could chill for a second. But, oh, it delivered, y'all. Oh, snap. Not DHL delivered, and I didn't even know. Oh, yeah, we do got a little package outside. So, yeah, I need to hurry up. I need to hurry up because DHL delivered. So, yeah, let me clean up, and I'm going to check back. Y'all, I just made me some lemon water with my cute pink floral knife set. Like, y'all, is this not cute? It come with the scissors. It come with the potato peeler. It comes with these knives and it also came with this stand so not this stand y'all what is this called cutting board <laughs> i said stand the cutting board so i made me some lemon water i'm about to put that in the fridge 
My cauliflower wings is done, so I'm about to eat that. And then we gonna finish. Okay, y'all, I'm feeling all fresh and clean. I just took a shower. So now I'm about to see what package this is. This is the one that was left outside. Before I went to the gym, it is my Shein package. So stay tuned for the next vlog. I'm not gonna do it in this vlog. Well, actually, this is not even everything. So these are three of the bathing suit sets, sneak peek. I did try to get everything pink. So this is just three of them because y'all know she and be shipping in um, split shipments anyway. So these are three of my bathing suits. So stay tuned if you want to see in the next vlog. And y'all, the package I've been waiting for. My cookie tray. So we are going to be baking cookies today. So right now it's 513. Dang, so I have less than an hour to pack orders and bake cookies because I do want to pack orders before my Patreon live is in less than an hour because I told y'all the time changed to six. So I have less than an hour, but I'm low key hungry. But today I want to eat um, burgers for dinner. I thought about trying the, um, have y'all tried the, what is it called? With the onions. I thought about trying that, but I was like, nah, we just gonna have, you know, a regular cheeseburger on some toast, okay? So let me get my content of me finishing cleaning up. Then I'm going to, then I'm gonna record. Y'all, I'm so proud of myself when I tell y'all, I told y'all I'm taking my personal branding serious, okay, for the next two months. So the fact that my lemon water, I recorded that video, I have it saved for tomorrow. This is gonna be an unboxing video that I'm gonna do the video of me baking the cookies. Then I'm gonna do a video of me making pig in a blanket today as well so that could be my breakfast for tomorrow and then because tomorrow i'm not gonna be home all day then what else do we need to record so i'm gonna go ahead and take out my hot dog and my croissant bread for that and i'm gonna get this stuff done and then we're gonna check in i'm gonna check in with you guys while i'm processing hey y'all so this is one of my private label lip gloss orders so cute brand your business with eye tasty so the boxes have the ingredients i do all the work so you don't have to the ingredients the directions you can choose any two from the catalog link is in the description box if you want to brand your business with eye tasty start your business with eye tasty lashes lip glosses everything you need but i just wanted to show you guys this really cute order for one of my private label orders. hey y'all this is another private label order she got the lip oil and the lip scrub so cute like if you want to brand your business whether you want to start a side hustle or actually build a brand like is it not giving sephora you guys like look at the packaging link in the description box itasty.com and let me help you brand your business hey y'all so i packed orders i did run out of medium flat rate boxes that's why i have that in that box and i'm gonna just do it at the post office when i go tomorrow so now we're about to make cookies y'all i realize this is kind of lavender i feel like the cookie rack is pink but this baking tray i don't know let me know y'all i feel like it's lavender but either way it goes, we still gonna use it. So I'm about to go ahead and brown my butter and we're gonna do that. Y'all, I think while my butter is browning, I'm probably gonna go ahead and work on my pig in a blanket because it's not gonna take me that long to wrap it. But I do gotta like clean up all this stuff over here. So I think I'm just gonna set everything aside for real quick. I'm just gonna set everything aside because I want it to give the illusion that I'm recording these on different days as far as like, you know, my reels go. I don't want it to be like I'm making cookies and like, you know, picking a blanket at the same at the same time. So I'm gonna clear up my counter space and I'm gonna put my ingredients for my picking a blanket and I'm gonna start working on that while I have my butter browning in the pot because that's gonna take a minute because it has to be on low heat. Okay, so this is what I'm using. So I'm going to make it really quickly and then I'm going to come back and show you guys when I'm done. Hey y'all, so they ready to go in the oven. I made a whole mess, but cookie dough is finally made. So I'm about to put it in the freezer for 30 minutes. And then I already have my oven preheated. So I'm just going to put this in the freezer for 30 minutes so that it could kind of like solidify. And then um, I'm gonna bake me like three of them and then I'm going to call it a Hey y'all, so I'm about to bake my cookies. Ooh, y'all, they look so good. 
Y'all, so I want to get at least like one close-up video of me breaking the cookie from my reel. So I'm going to just show y'all that as well. So we're going to do this cookie. And I'm just going to show y'all. About to taste test. If you watch this video all the way to this point, if you are a true supporter of mine, comment what your favorite cookie flavor is. Is it chocolate chip? Is it oatmeal raisin? Is it sugar? What other cookie flavors they got? They got a bunch of different flavors. Mm, mm, mm. I do got some ice cream in the flavor freezer. <laughs> I said flavor. I got some ice cream in the freezer, but we're not gonna eat that today. Cause I'm not even supposed to be eating this. I'm trying to be on a diet. I've been eating healthy all day. Protein drink, cauliflower wings, and then I had a burger with spinach and tomatoes. So I'm just gonna eat one cookie because it's already 10.30 at night. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. I already took my steak off for tomorrow. So tomorrow, I probably have some other steak and rice. And then maybe Wednesday I'll go grocery shopping. Mm -mm -mm. But thank you guys so much for watching. If you're a true supporter of mine, let me know that by commenting your favorite cookie flavor. Don't forget to hit the like button. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to run out the views of my other videos. And I will see you guys on the next vlog.